Hey, hey, y'all. It is your girl, Touche B336 Tarot. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank y'all for stopping by. Uh, we're at the beach, y'all. We're at the beach. This is actually my daily practice. I come to the beach every day, and Spirit told me, Spirit Nim, <laughs> okay, Spirit Nim told me this morning before I left the house to grab some tarot cards because I was supposed to read for my air signs, my air signs, my air signs. Because I am reading for air signs today. Today is Monday. Um, traditionally, I know a lot of times for everybody, it's the beginning of the week. It's a mental Monday. But what we're going to do, what our goal is and what our purpose is today is to turn mental Mondays into magical moments Mondays. Okay? Magical moments. Manifest something. Make, make your magic today. That's what we're going to do. So we are going to read for the air signs today. Y'all, I don't know. I, I Right now, I don't know because I am recording and can't see. It's planes flying over my head. I hope the water's not too loud. I hope I'm not too loud. I feel like I'm kind of yelling because the water is uh, kind of loud, but I love it here. It is definitely my place to be in. So we're going to go ahead and get started, and uh, let's see what we got. Again, we the goal, the goal for today, Air Signs, I'm going to start with you, Gemini. Gemini. I am a Gemini rising. So I am starting with Gemini for the first Gemini. This is your reading Mondays. I feel like Mondays are going to be de devoted to my air signs. So uh, make sure you check me out. Make sure you check me out. And if you did not watch my weekly reading from yesterday, I did give a seven day energy breakdown. And what's crazy is for Monday, we had the eight of swords in the weekly. So y'all make sure you go check out my weekly reading because I did that yesterday. Okay. But let's go ahead and jump in, Gemini. What do you have for today? What do you have, y'all? And if you know, you know, I am an Alabama fan. Now, this was not the goal. Okay. This is, I was not trying to just put it out there like that. But yeah, I'm an Alabama fan. Roll Tide. But I just grabbed a towel. Like, that's the only thing I had to put my stuff on because I. <laughs> So sorry, y'all. I digress. But let's go. Let's go, Gemini. What we got? We have the Six of Pentacles. Okay, then the Chariot and the Judgment card and Manifestation card for to make your your Monday magical today. What do we have? Come through, Spirit. Show me truth and clarity. Synchronicity number fifty one. And then let's give y'all a little guidance to help you work through your Monday mental blues. If you're having any, we're going to pull you out of that. That's the goal and the purpose. Already sending lots of love, light, and healing energy to you. All right. And we have number 30, the garden and the gate. So let's go. Let's go. So, all right, Gemini, what do we got here? So first of all, it looks amazing. Okay. You have the six of pentacles, which is definitely telling me that if you are starting the week off, um, from a very mental place. It's Monday. We understand. We get it. You know what I'm saying? But we definitely want to try to bring that back. We want to be a little balanced. And you're going to have some help from spirit to do that, okay? Um, you have to realize that it's just another day. And tomorrow is going to be another day. And the day after that is going to be another day. So we want to make sure that we're balancing ourselves out today, okay? Take some time. Like, even if it's just this, watch this video a little later, turn mute it and just look at the ocean and just reconnect with yourself. I'm definitely feeling like you need to give yourself a little extra energy, a little extra attention today. I read intuitively, you guys, so I don't just regurgitate and spit out whatever the card meaning is, but you can look up the six of pentacles. It is definitely a card of balance. Okay. Then you have the chariot coming in, come through spirit nymph. OK, because the chariot is all about success. It's about moving forward. It's about as above, so below. It is about you moving towards what is going to be best for you. And you don't have some help from your spirit, spirit guides, ancestors and angels. Connect with yourself. I'm also getting on this chariot. Your, your soul needs a little nurturing, a little extra love. It's Monday. It may have been a hard weekend, even if it wasn't. Make sure that you are balancing yourself out by telling when you're overthinking. Tell yourself, you know what? I'm not going to do this. I am going to bring this back to reality. I'm going to ground myself. I'm going to stay present and I'm going to live in this moment. 
And then followed by that, you have the judgment card, which is also, if you look on this card, y'all, I hope y'all can see. I don't know how the camera is because of where I'm sitting. Anyway, don't judge me. Okay. So <laughs> we have the judgment card, which is all about making sure you're staying balanced and giving your, your chance a, another chance to rebalance if when you feel like you get out of balance. This is just a daily reading, y'all. This is not a, a end all and be all. You can do this. You got this. You're being called to just kind of step back, take a look, relax, and make sure that you are showing yourself some love, synchronicities. You're going to start seeing the same things over and over, okay? It, make sure that you're listening to yourself. You may have an inclination to, to do something, and then your, little, your, your spirit self be like, yeah, nah, we're not doing that today. The garden, what I'm feeling on the garden in the gate. You definitely want to pay attention to synchronicities insofar as I'm seeing butterflies, birds, okay? This is a chance. Today is Monday. This you're, You hadn't even gone out the gate yet, okay? You, you hadn't even walked out. But look how beautiful it is on the other side. Come out of your head, making sure that you are coming from a very grounded place. Take a couple breaths, okay? Breathe in for three seconds. And breathe out for three seconds, okay? You can do this. You got this. This is the start of the week. We're going to have a fantastic week. You you, you just have to start believing that. Stay grounded. You got this, Gemini. You got this. Um, pay attention to, the, to outside and to nature. I'm definitely getting on this synchronicity again. Uh, when you see a spirit, uh, uh, a butterfly, that's your spirit saying, it's okay. I got you. We, we got this. And we are going to get through this day. There's nothing that you cannot accomplish today. I am so proud of you for just waking up and telling yourself and watching this video and say it, even if it's just today, making a 1% improvement in your life every day can be the most phenomenal thing that you can do for yourself. And it works, y'all. It works. So again, Thank you so much for being here, Gemini. I hope this was helpful for you. Sending lots and lots and lots of love, light, and positive healing energy to you. Have a great rest of your day. Bye.